I'm Greg Yorgi Gerdy. He's Paul Yorgi Gerdy. We just had a name change. And this is Trevor. He's 23 months old. And Xander just turned two. And Bella's six going on 30. Paul and I met uh, at, at a nightclub. And I wasn't supposed to go out that night. Um, and I went out with a friend because he wanted to meet someone. And Paul happened to have on a Texas t-shirt, uh, which I'm a big Longhorn fan. And uh, so I approached him, asked him, did he go to University of Texas? And he said no. Didn't even know he had a Texas shirt on. He said it matched his shoes. So, whatever. Sounds all right. <laughs> That's how we met. So Xander uh, came to us. He was born on November the 14th. They uh, let us know that you know there was some medical issues with him. So on the 20th, they said he was ready to be picked up. We had to go out and get a car seat and uh, you know go pick him up from the hospital. In the beginning, they were saying his kidneys weren't fully healthy and that he might need a kidney transplant. You know, by the age of two, now he's two, and both his kidneys are. 100%. We always had faith that, well at least I knew Xander was coming. I didn't have any, I just just faith. So when he did come, of course it was some obstacles, but I knew that everything would be all right. Um, and he's a strong kid, so. And then Trevor came to us uh, when he was eight, uh, 10 months old. It was mischief the day Halloween. before Halloween. Uh, you know, my family calls it mischief night because we go to toilet paper at each other's houses. But uh, so he came in. I'm, I, you know, it was very unexpected. I'm planning on going to toilet paper at my cousin's house, and we get a call that you know uh, Trevor was going to come to our house that day. I think our aha moment when uh, we, you know, felt like a family was. You know, but even though we had our moments with me, just me and Greg, was uh, when Bella came. When Bella came, and we realized, wow, we're daddies. You know, that was uh, that was my aha moment. My aha moment was Father's Day, the first Father's Day. Um, I, I mean, I rarely celebrated Father's Day, uh, but when people would say Happy Father's Day, it felt weird. It didn't feel weird. It just felt weird that I finally was told Happy Father's Day. I think that was the first aha uh, moment for me. 